Hey guys and welcome back to another satisfactory tips video this time showing you how to do horizontal walls like this as well as wall features like this. So the first thing you want to do is lay down the foundation where you want your horizontal wall to be. Now you can make this horizontal wall as big as you want but for me I use three. Now in this first corner you want to place down a road barrier so it's horizontal with the foundation below like that now grab a wall and set it so that it's in the middle of the second barrier press control and it'll overwrite that barrier you can delete the top then you come over to this side and do the same The reason you want to do it from both sides is when you place down the foundation against the wall and bring it across by two, you have a gap. So what you want to do is bring this one over by three and this one over by three. That way, depending on what road you're using or foundation, the like image is the same and sort of reflects on both sides. So you've got your wall. And now you can bring this up as much as you want. And there you go. So now that you've got your horizontal wall, you could add depth to it by deleting the top foundations now inside here you can place a beam from this corner to here and then you could add some signs inside so we'll put this one here make sure this lines up and then put this one here as long as it's not clipping through the other side it doesn't matter if it's center or not come over here we'll just paste down a pattern and then we've got a nice pattern inside. You could also put down some concrete pillars or metal pillars. And then just spread these apart as you wish. And then you can just put the foundations back on top. Once that's like that, delete the middle ones. And there you go. You've got a horizontal wall with some interesting features. Now, at the side, if we bring down this foundation more, instead of a plain side wall like this, you could delete it all, place down some 2 meter foundations, and then in the middle here, place down a road barrier you put it center into here you could select any kind of wall that you want so let's go for the metal wall and you could have a metal wall feature now you could also place down some curved ramps or ramps And you can just play around with these however you see fit. Just adds a little depth to walls. Now you can also do this with signs again. So place down a road barrier. Select your wall.
bring this across. And on this wall, we can place a sign. Once again, we'll just paste the pattern. And now you have a bit of a feature on that wall. Now, if you put down some ramps, um, not on the right one, there we go. And you could have a nice little feature wall. There you go. Adds a bit of colour and depth to your walls. Now at the back you do have an empty gap and all you have to do is just place down whatever wall that you want to use and just blend it in. And there you go. Now, what you could do as well, if you wanted to, is you could add some signs that are rotated down the foundation. So, to add rotated foundations, just place a wall at the back here. Bring out your pillars, which then you can attach vertically along the wall. Now, with pillars, you can then add signs to the end of them but you can also rotate them. So then if you wanted to, you could put your signs down here. And you could just put whatever color you want. And there you go. And you could do this however you want. If you wanted to, you could tilt it so it's horizontal and bring it down. And you could technically create an arrow if you wanted to. The possibilities are endless. So yeah, that's a few more tips that I thought I'd show you. Hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one.